One of DC's most popular Michelin starred restaurants is Rose's Luxury. It's so popular in fact that when I arrived 15 minutes before it opened, there was already quite a line. But don't let that discourage you, many just arrived to put their names down to reserve a table for later. As a single diner, I was seated right away at the kitchen counter, which gave me a nice view of the action. I love the design of the restaurant, it has a great and inviting feel. The menu mainly consists of small plates with a couple of large options meant for sharing. The free bread course came out first, which is becoming a rarity in fine dining restaurants. It was fresh, warm, tasty. I am so glad that I don't have a gluten intolerance because it was wonderful. My first course was the crispy cauliflower with golden raisins, white truffles, and Greek yogurt. It was a great start to the meal. Next was the lychee salad with pork sausage, habaneros, and peanuts. Once everything is mixed together, it creates an amazing array of flavors and textures. I love this dish. After that, I had the grilled island chicken thighs with two sauces. One was the Rosa's Peppa Joy, and the other was a pina colada sauce. Both are great and impart a nice flavors to pieces of perfectly cooked chicken. For dessert, I had the eggplant 2.0. Yes, you heard me right, there's an eggplant underneath a layer of puff pastry with milk ice cream and pine nuts. It sounds like a crazy ingredient contestants on the TV show Chopped would be required to make a dessert with, but it worked. It was delicious. The eggplant was caramely and provided a welcoming contrast to the crispness of the pastry and the smoothness and cool temperature from the ice cream. I highly recommend this dessert. Next, the check came with a nice piece of sesame brittle. Well, getting the bill is usually the worst part of the meal. In reality, the restaurant was quite affordable, especially for one with a Michelin star. I can't recommend this restaurant enough. No matter how long you have to wait in line or the hoops you have to go through, it's worth it. 